I tend to look at behavioral issues in hospitality businesses and tourism communities. Uh, within those two areas, my number one area of research is visitor harassment, um, which is a behavioral issue in tourism communities, in particular the harassment of visitors by micro entrepreneurs and within the hospitality space I tend to look at exceptionalism um, so how do we get our employees to be super performers everything I do really pivots on um, getting persons to thrive in terms of the micro entrepreneurs my research centers on how to make them excellent at what they do so that they generate wealth, the visitor is happy, um, and the community benefits overall. Um, in the area of hospitality business, employees thriving as well is crucial to what I do. Is how do I get, how do we get employees to demonstrate the highest levels of performance so that the business does well and they also will do well financially. So everything I do centers around um, these two groups thriving and ultimately communities thriving. One of my greatest passions, which is not strange considering my area of research is to visit markets. I just love to see when the markets are humming, um, when the vendors are doing well, they're selling, they're teaching, because a big part of what they do is share their culture, and when the visitors have a fantastic experience. Even though it is so prevalent, um, it is also one of the least researched areas. Uh, a number of the forerunners in this area, they have passed, deceased. Uh, so there is the need, but few scholars pursuing this area um, and being from the Caribbean, all those things tying together, why I am so um, driven and passionate about this particular area of research. The sustainable and thriving communities, um, I call it cluster or signature area, means a lot to me. It's an opportunity for us to sit and talk, um, for us to learn what each other is doing. Uh, I would say, yeah, and to support each other, see how we can assist, see how we can collaborate. Uh, very important as well. 